A series of devastating diagnoses for one LAPD family. Now fellow officers are coming together to help as the bills are piling up. KKL 9's Joy Benedict shows us how loved ones are pitching in. It's been a pretty rough few months. It's a tough diagnosis for any family. As earlier this year, Laura Tamuloso was diagnosed with aggressive colon cancer. But before she could even get through her treatment, this family of four got another devastating call. Then in June, uh, Michael found out that he also had cancer. LAPD officer Michael Tomaloso, Laura's husband, was diagnosed with stage four throat cancer. Sylvia Mitchell is his sister. Michael had radiation and chemo every day for almost eight weeks. He's unable to eat anything solid um, during that time and still um, he had to have a feeding tube um, you know, inserted. So now his fellow officers are rallying to help this family. It hits close to home when it's someone who's walking the same path in life. Officer Rob Golden used to work in the motor division with Officer Tomaloso at LAPD's Central Traffic Division. He has a servant's heart, so he's always helped others and put others before him, beginning with his family and then to the community at large. Mike Tomaloso joined the Marine Corps after high school and has served the city of Los Angeles for 25 years. His wife worked for the FBI, but left to homeschool their younger son with special needs. They are now surviving on state disability. Right now they're using their personal insurance policy and they're coming out of pocket. They're dipping into retirement. They're dipping into savings to help cover everything. It's one thing to have one person in a household dealing with cancer, but to have two people in the same home going through the same battle, it really limits this home and this family. Yeah, it really does. They're both going to chemotherapy and radiation you know, appointments together and everyone knows about the effects after that and how you're, you're just drained and you don't have any energy and you feel sick and you can barely get out of bed. And although Laura just found out she will need more treatments, Officer Tomaloso just finished his and is hopeful. They're staying positive, as positive as you can um, at this time. And thanks to family, friends, church members, and the Brethren in Blue, they are surviving. But fellow officers are hoping with some financial help, they can focus on what matters most, simply healing. During, you know, this holiday season, you know, what, what better time, but, you know, to lift them up not only in prayer, but also to help them financially. The Los Angeles Police Federal Credit Union has opened up a blue ribbon fund to try and help this family. If you'd like more information, we have it all for you on our website at KCAL9.com. Joy Benedict, KCAL9 News.